Hey everybody, what's up? Madman here, and welcome back to Let's Play Sid Meier's Civilization Revolution. Let's continue back into Glitchland. So, guys, how was your weekend? Hopefully it went well. The uh, obvious beta test I did with Battleborn, there we go. Totally slipped my mind there for a second. Obviously, the beta test was a success because I can do face cam now using my laptop again instead of using my cell phone, which is good because, well, I'll save time and space on my iPhone. I wish I had it around here, but no, oh, it's right behind me. But either way, guys, I'm glad I was able to get the face cam. Not to mention, now I don't have to constantly look awkwardly down here. I actually got my uh, webcam right underneath my Xbox One Connect. Yeah, if you guys bought the Xbox One with the Connect package, in the Connect, that little slit between the base and the camera itself, I stuck it right in there. So, <laughs> kind of reminds me when I actually live stream using the uh, Twitch app. So. Yeah, it's, it's pretty cool I actually was able to do that. My weekend was pretty good. Actually, it was perfect. Actually, I got to spend time with my girlfriend, so yay. And also, on my way home from hanging out with my girlfriend, I found out the, my local gas station actually sells Surge again. So, yay. <sighs> yeah, I remember a while back, Surge and Mountain Dew were like in a battle for soda dominance, I guess you could say. Like right now, I'm going for cultural domination. Surge and Mountain Dew for going for soda dominance. But Surge got pulled off the shelves to, because the FDA said it was an energy drink, not a soda. So it got pulled for the dumbest reasons. Ooh, ah, and we're taking over Limp Zig. And there's Stuttergart. I'm probably pronouncing these cities completely incorrect, aren't I? Ah, Frankenfurter! Okay, no walls and yeah, this is gonna be a this area right here. Is um, I don't know why I built that here, and I still don't understand why my game is glitched up. And oh yeah, now I remember why I was panicking before playing this game again. The Romans, uh, hey Rome, what did you guys want again? We take navigation. Oh, there we go. We made peace with Caesar, and the Romans replaced monarchy with democracy. And I also just realized something, guys, that uh, the courthouse in New York was built, which is very good. Ooh, we got a lot more food. Okay, we got an archer army, but what else is there that we can build that's actually good? Oh, a harbor is available. Sweet! You're building riflemen, you're building riflemen, you got walls next turn. Okay. Now you should be able to build up. Still not? Man, that's kind of stupid. Either way. Oh man, I completely forgot what I was about to say. That's the only problem with doing commentaries. You completely forget what you're about to say. And it actually just popped back in my head. It, I was watching Game Grumps uh, Let's Play of Civilization V, and they actually had beef with, uh, not at Julius Caesar. I have beef with Julius Caesar. Uh, Game Grumps have beef with Augustus Caesar, so... Yeah, I believe Danny said it best. Where Julius Caesar, he's such a douchebag. And then Ross just no, it's Augustus cereal, Augustus cereal. Yes, Augustus cereal available in Sid Meier's Civilization universe. And seriously, how long would it take before us to take this town? I mean, we got yeah, we got we got a uh, monarchy. What else can we? What else? What other wonders are there? Uh, a lot more, but first, let's just end this turn, because I've been talking about non-stop. My commentary skills are definitely getting better. I'm definitely happy about that. Hey, we took it in the next town. Sweet! We took it in the next town. No, we took another town. Hmm. Okay, put a new temple in there, just to continue our... Whoa, whoa, hold on a sec. Back up, back up, back up. Well, I'm glad we got the walls, though. Now, build a courthouse. Courthouse is for everybody. Let me just see, which one is it ch it's chucking out more gold than science? And seriously, this is this is just absolutely crazy. And... Oh, jeez. Oh, oh my god, what is with the color scheme? It looks like a weather pattern. Well, unfortunately, we have some storms brewing in the harbor. Well, only in civilization. Why not? I got the gold. I can buy whatever. Now... Well, they're chucking out gold. So, you know what? Build a marketplace. Okay, I don't understand this. I can't build a harbor. I can build a harbor right here, which is like literally just a, a lake. But I can't build one here in uh, Uma's. <sighs> Seriously, that's... 
Well, there is no logic in this game. Nothing makes sense. Uh, what else can I do? Seems like I'm chucking out more gold in science. No, that's not true. No, I'll wait for that one to be done. I'm not gonna waste all that gold on a harbor. <laughs> well, we're definitely winning in the cultural category, ladies and gentlemen. Economics, we're, well, we're in a three-way tie. And for technology, Rome is ahead of us. And we only need seven more items. We got engineering now. Ooh, engineering. We, we can definitely build the Taj Mahal. The Taj Mahal basically makes it at all our buildings we build. I don't know if it's for every city or just in the capital city. I think it's just in the capital city. Then gives us one plus culture. A great thing to go for if you're going for the cultural victory. Mm hmm But let's see. Well, all right, let's turn to religion so we can get, get the cathedral. Now, how many more? Seriously, it takes you two turns to do that. Hmm. How many cities do I actually have producing? I actually have a good chunk of people producing science and gold. I actually have a good balance. I'm happy about that. And Washington replaces Berlin. Yes. Our plan for world domination using culture is a success! And what's gonna happen this turn? Oh no, a boat approaches! And now we have religion. No, we'll stick with monarchy, thank you! And metal, yeah, or... Hmm. Metallurgy, because come on, we need cannons. <laughs> we got another city that's to join us. Woohoo! Okay, and as usual, we start off by building a temple. And, whoa! Caesar, you know what? Yeah, why not? Okay, so Caesar just gave us the atomic theory for religion. Apparently he's building the Church of Adam! Form an army. You form an army. You just settle there. You settle there. And let me just return to the city of Washington. And you, sir, you're gonna build the Manhattan Project. God knows we can't let a nuke go into Caesar's control. That would just 125 turns. Uh huh. What if you just put it on production? 84 turns. You know what? Um. Uh, you know what? Go for it. Why not? 125 turns. It's going to take us forever to build it, but you know what? Fuck it. And, holy shit, Berlin's right there. I got a feeling that they're probably going to want that back. Especially since I think our... Is there a way we... Yes, let there be peace. Uh, you know what? I have some knowledge for sale. Um, let's see here. Now, this is just a theory that one of my friends had a while back in one of his Let's Plays, but he believes if you actually sell technology or interact with them, it kind of pushes them away from like coming up to you saying like, hey, give us some shit or we'll declare war on you. And even if you do give us what we want, we'll still declare war on you. So, you know, let's give him feudalism. Alright, there we go. Uh, let's discuss world events. Uh, how is President Caesar the Romans? The Romans are annoying people. I would consider it a public service to raise them from that. It would require 300 gold for to cover incidental expenses for five turns. Perhaps you'd like... You know what? Yes! Flay them without mercy! Thank you, Autobound Bismarck, for the assistance. Yes, yes, march off camera and go to war with the Romans. Now we're playing politics! <laughs> Sorry, I must get back to work. <laughs> so hopefully with that, uh, <laughs> I think Caesar is probably going to hate us a little more, but oh well. See ya! <laughs> oh come on, I just gave you shit, man! No! Okay, yeah, I convinced you. Yeah, you're going to war with the Romans and you're asking me for a great person. I gave you freaking feudalism, man. I gave you knights. I gave you a lot of crazy shit. Seriously, man. Not cool. Ooh, Jonas Gutenberg. Is he a great builder? No. Humanitarian. You know what? I'll have him go to New York. Eh. 
the same boat shows up. You know what? And we'll settle you. We'll settle you, John, Jonas Gutenberg, in the city of New York. You know what? Now that's a lot of food. Now get to building a cathedral. You're wait. You already have an army. So why don't we just apply those resources to say uh, cathedral? We're building the Manhattan Project. You're, buy that. Now build a cathedral. You're building a courthouse. That's good. You're. Where I got that good. So why don't we just put something else there in its place? Um, cathedral. Okay, everything else is good. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I don't care about that. Now we got more courthouses built in Boston. And you know what? You get a cathedral as well. Get and the temple is built there. You will build a cathedral because court you know courthouses and cathedrals for everybody. Okay. And seriously, 104 turns. It's 19 it's 1905, and we're building the Manhattan Project. What? How long would it take to build the Taj Mahal? 25 turns. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna say let's just stick with that for now. Let's go for a straight up cultural victory. The, the Taj Mahal is just an amazing. It's just amazing to have to have a cultural for a cultural victory right there. And it's 1915. Hmm. Can we just get a little uh, who's winning? Let's just see who's winning. Okay, I just need one, two, three. Okay, it's either I need three more and then the United Nations, or I need four more and then I get the United Nations. Either way, guys, we pretty much got this one in the bag. And next time on Let's Play Sid Meier's Civilization Revolution, I'm totally just building up suspense for the next episode. <sighs> Seriously, I hopefully this glitch that's currently going on doesn't spread throughout the rest of the game. I mean, that would be funny. It would be funny to have, but um, I, I just don't know, guys. I just don't know. Either way, guys, I'm the Madman. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. You know you won't. I'll see you guys later.